Hi, it's Chris. I'm here on the Trenton Mersey Canal in a place called Sandon. It's about five miles from Great Hayward. Uh, it's a dull and overcast day. I've just been there. Uh, I've parked up at Great Hayward, which is that way. It's about three miles. And I'm just approaching Sandon Lock. Some sheep over there. This is the lock here. It's the last lock before Aston Lock, where the poppies moored at the marina. The towpath is quite muddy, all the rain we've had. There's not many people about today. That's a fair wash, that is. You just let line the boat up to go in the lock, and that turns you. That's one of the quite fierce, that is. It's alright when you're coming out of the lot, but you've got to line it up to go there. And that gush, that overfeed just throws you over to the side, it's horrible. Like I say, it's quite fierce, that is. You don't take much pushing over, boats don't. This is Bridge 83. That's a nice quaint cottage there. Old uh, lock house by the looks of it. There isn't many boats about. Uh, there's a bridge down there. It's a place called Salt. They do major repairs on that so no boats can go that far down. And uh, on Monday Aston Lock is shut, which is the next lock up. It's about three miles to the Aston Lock. I say it's quite busy usually, this is. If you watch these uh, cobbles, they're quite slippy. The shoes are not the best for grips. What a lovely cottage that is. The only thing is you need a wa running water all the time and you're forever running the toilet and then there's some of the clacking gates first thing so you wouldn't get a lie in so this is sand and lock lovely place in the summer this is can't wait to see all the greens on the trees again everything's so bare Just up there is a winding hole. About half a mile up there. The railway's over there. Another nice property there. So I'll just carry on with my walk. Hope you all have a great day. And you keep on subscribing to me and give me the thumbs up. So, see you later. Bye.